I haven't seen this lake this low in decades. It may have been this low, but I haven't seen it. See how steep that point is right there, the closest one? That's how steep the shore is I'll be standing on trying to fish. Well, less water. Hopefully there's at least fish concentrated in this area. There's a bridge at the other end of the lake that's normally underwater because there used to be a little community down here maybe 80, 100 years ago before they made the lake. That bridge is visible now. It's just starting to stick out of the water. So, yeah, this is bad. This actually feels pretty good, dude, to be back on the banks, climbing around. It's been a while. <sighs> All right, folks, back to my roots here, I guess. I'm gonna do some bank fishing today. I don't feel like dragging out the kayak. My back's been bothering me a little, so I kinda don't wanna haul around, so. I'm gonna try right now a Texas rigged worm or maybe a craw on there. And I got a spinnerbait tied on because it's a little bit cloudy. I haven't cast this a while, I just repaired the tip. I should throw the T rig out there to see how far it sinks. Alright, folks, I'm at Chesbro, my least favorite lake. But I just wanted to fish today. I need to get out of the house and I can't really get my kayak out right now. So just let you guys know, man, just because I got a new kayak doesn't mean my bank fishing days are over. Um, you know, I didn't feel like putting that thing on my roof of my van today to fish on a Sunday at Calero because it's crowded and I just let my back heal from a little, it's a little sore. So i to do some bank fishing today and get out of the house. I have not fished since that day at uh, the Delta in my last video, so. I'm finally getting out there. It's been two weeks. I'm going to go out on Claro in a couple days with the yak, so don't worry. There'll be more videos, hopefully with fish. I don't think I'm going to catch... I don't want to say it out loud. I'm not going to catch anything here. <laughs> it's possible, but... <sighs> yeah, that's me if I make a wrong turn. <sighs> yeah, I'm going in the water with these rocks, dude. Fucking anything happen. This is steep. <laughs> this is not easy, man. I don't see any re easy way to get around that corner. I'm gonna go back up. <sighs> God damn. A little run at. It's gonna lose here. Whoa. <sighs> snakes. Well, I didn't realize this point was here. Folks, I'm going to give you a really good reason not to buy those cheap spinner baits at Walmart. See anything missing here? The skirt? Gone. In fact, all of my Walmart spinner bait skirts are gone. So I'm not going to buy those anymore. Yeah, you can put a wire tie on it probably. Hey, maybe they'd be worth it. I don't know. They are a couple years old. They've been sitting in the heat for a while, so that may have damaged them. You know, it's just a little rubber band around them and it went bad. If you're gonna buy cheap Walmart spinner baits, I recommend at least uh, wiring the band or something yourself and strengthening it, because it's gonna come apart. All right, so I'm leaving. <laughs> I've been here for maybe an hour or so, maybe, but I'm not feeling it. I just need to get out of the house for a little while and throw a line in the water and uh, remember what it feels like. But now I'm remembering what Chesbro feels like. Crap! <laughs> so, but it's cool, I got out of the house, burned a little energy today. I've been having a hard time lately, so I really needed this. So I'll see you guys in a couple of days out my kayak, okay? All right, till then, go fishing, huh?